Yo, what's up, people? Maddie Deeve and the Black here. Uh, you know, helping you achieve emotional, financial, and physical well-being, and your coach here at helping you get off, get over your, uh, you know, emotional crap from your parents. So this video is the mother wound part dos, do two. Um, have you seen the first one? The link for it in the description. I'm itchy as I'm doing this video. I don't know why. Whatever. So. Um, the first video talks about what this all, what is the mother wound exactly, because it's an interesting concept. Um, and I do mention in the video uh, that if you're a man looking this up, you'll find a ton of information. I don't say ton, a lot, of, a lot of information about the mother wound for women, and it's defined as you know the pains of the mom that are passed on to daughters in a patriarchal society. So. It, it's like completely excludes men, which is complete bullshit. Like, if you have two parents, all it takes is one parent to have issues, and you have two kids, those, the, the issues that that parent has and refuses to deal with is going to negatively impact both children. So I don't know why the definition is still prevailing to this day. It's so stupid. So what do we talk about? What am I going to discuss here? It's like, okay, so you, may, so you have identified it, right? This is all about saying... You gotta deal with this shit because if you go back and you think about your mom in a relationship you have with her, um, and this is, I should have said this earlier, this is really, this video is really geared towards men. That the issues you have with her are affecting you right now. Not maybe, not if, they are and they have been and will continue to do so until you to, you know, do the work and just face your fears, bro and deal with it. And here's the thing, I will address this. If you're of the belief that it's not cool for men to admit their feelings and stuff, well guess what? That's bullshit because you're a human being. Men or women, you have feelings, you have emotions, okay? And it's not healthy as men, at least in the United States, and would think in other cultures too, all right? But 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 specifically for the United States, I won't say, you know, North America and Canada, that it's only appropriate to show anger. And you can only cry if someone dies and all this like stupid things. But only being able to express express yourself through anger isn't healthy. Anger is necessary. It's part of our emotional spectrum. But if that's the only way you can express yourself, it's wrong. I mean, I don't say it's wrong, but it's not healthy. It's not, it's not the best optimal way to operate, okay? You may be afraid to deal with this. You may be afraid to, to admit that there's a woman. Like a lot of men don't work on the issues because a lot of us are afraid to admit that we have an issue with the problems. Oh my God, it's bad. It's just a judgment. Like let these things go. Like what if acknowledging that you have this issue or wound, you know, this behavior or un unresolved emotions with your mother allows you to, you know, have a better life and be happier, be freer, you know? Would you, were you willing to let that go? If so, let it go, let it go, let it go. And so it is, my friend, you know? It's okay to admit that you have these unresolved emotions that need to be let out. Let them go, let them go, let them go. And so it is, let it be, my friend, let it be. Just tackle the issues. It's gonna take some time. It's not gonna be easy, by any means necessary. Simple things you can do, still gonna be a process, I'm telling you, by atta by attacking these wounds, these emotional issues you have, if you don't, you continue to get the same type of life and bullshit emotions you have with women and yourself and other people over and over and over again. You may think, oh, that's not true. Yeah, well, look at your life. I mean, the question you ask yourself is, what kind of relationship are you, are you in right now? Is, is, is it the one you want? Two, are you in a relationship you have? Three, you know, what 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 have, what's been your relationships with women has been women that are that you're like why am i attracting the same type of woman where it's like those issues she has and criticize me and i'm trying to meet stuff you know you look at that look at your own results look what you're doing because you're you're doing a pattern over and over again that is unconscious that once you're aware of it then you can then you can change it so short and sweet the point is is, is start working on the wound now resolve the emotions we'll feel them out if you're gonna cry cry it out cry again i don't care if you cry 20 times in the next 20 days or 40 times. Get it out, get out the anger, okay? I always say, if you're feeling angry against your mother or somebody, feel out the emotion. Simply start doing some deep breaths. Long inhale, long exhale, long inhale, long exhale. Where do you feel the emotion in your body? Put your hand there, continue to breathe until you don't feel it anymore. And you'll know when you don't feel it anymore because you'll feel this release of, of energy. You'll feel this release, you'll go, ah. and look. If you need help with this, I am a coach. I'll guide you through these sessions. 
look, sign up for a newsletter, the link below, and look, you sign up for that session, you sign up for a newsletter. Not only do you get updates on the videos here and other stuff that I put in email, but you'll get a free coaching session, okay, to show you to show you how this works. And hopefully after that you see value and we can work together. So hope this makes sense. Otherwise, like I always say, you know, comment, let me your thoughts are, like this video, and hey, subscribe to the newsletter, bro. Link is in the description. Yeah. Get it back, my friend. Peace.